A boohoo order means one thing. It is time for my baby shower. Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, if you have watched my Chesington World of Adventures vlog, which has already been released, you will know that today it's my baby shower day. But I've also been at Chesington World of Adventures all morning. I got home at 6.15. It is now like 6.30. I'm meant to be at my meal at quarter past seven. I'm gonna leave by seven. So I'm trying to very, very quickly get ready, which is not happening, to be honest. I've used the wrong hair curler, so my hair is looking like a pile of poo. Um, it's kind of pointless me even curling it at this point, but we're just gonna carry on. We're, we're gonna keep going. Um, but yes, so I've come home from Chesington and Dan has surprised me with balloons, which is very, very cute. And also some money in a card, which means that he is paying for my meal tonight which is a great thing because I'm poor as F. Um, but yeah, I will show you guys that later. This is me still in the uh, clothes that I went to Chesington in. So hopefully I get time to change into the outfit, which is here. That is from Boohoo. I ordered about seven different outfits from Boohoo. Um, all were maternity apart from that one, and that is the only one I like. But I tried that on about four weeks ago. So we'll wait and see if I still like it when I try it on. Don't have any shoes to wear with it, so probably going to go in sandals. And by sandals, I mean 90p flip-flops from Primark, which probably don't match in colour. As you can tell, I definitely haven't planned very well for this, but I'm so excited. Um, I wasn't originally going to have a baby shower, as this is my second child. Um, but I'd mentioned to Dan that I'd like a milk, because my first baby shower wasn't the greatest, due to some family dramas but yes so oh god i'm gonna finish getting ready i'll show you guys what i look like when i'm done and i don't know how much i'm gonna film at my baby shower but if i get a chance i'll film those little bits and i'll explain it all tomorrow probably because i won't be able to film much tonight because i've been up since two but yeah I've just been rambling for two and a half minutes. So yeah, let me finish getting ready. I'll show you what I look like before I go. I'll see you in a bit. All right, so I'm now ready. I look, I stay. My hair is terrible. My outfit is nice. My makeup isn't great either. I'm not gonna lie. Kinda need to twist that back. Okay, I'm off. I'm off, I'm wearing heels, which I probably shouldn't be whilst driving. That is what we're doing. So we are going to a pub, the Crown and Cushion. Um, I have been there before. Last time I went, Orlando was like two weeks old. So yeah, I'm excited. I just need to get there now because I'm meant to be there in 10 minutes and it takes like 20 minutes to get there. Wish me luck. Morning from me and my son's bum. Um, as you can probably tell from watching this, I didn't film anything last night in my baby shower. Um, I didn't actually even get my phone out of my bag, which is so helpful when you're trying to do a vlog. But I had such a nice evening. I was there for about nearly three hours. Um, so instead of showing you what I did at my baby shower, which was a meal at the Crown and Cushion, uh, which is in, I think it's class of Surrey. Might be Hampshire, might be Berkshire, I don't know. They all kind of mix. Um, so yeah, went for a meal. Um, had some nice girly chats. But yeah, so instead of showing you what I did at my baby shower, let me show you what I got gifted. I was very, very spoiled. So first up, before Orlando attacks them again, these are the balloons that Dan got me. So we've got a baby girl balloon and a baby shower balloon. And this is where Orlando comes to tell him, boom, boom. So yeah, these are so cute. 
and dual purpose because Orlando can now play with them. Um, so yeah. Oh God, there goes Slinky. It's one of these mornings, kids. I'm so socially hungover, it is unreal. No, I did not drink, but yesterday was a full on day. Uh, Slinky doesn't want to fly in the balloons. He wasn't in up. He was in Toy Story. Should we show them some more presents? Yeah. In terms of like other decorations, so the girls made me this, which is the balloon castle with all their fingerprints. I'm gonna add mine down on all our nice fingerprints onto this as well. I then got baby prediction cards and on the other side, it's advice from the mummy. I actually filled this one out myself. Um, and some cute pink pens that we all filled it out with. And then also I got a mummy to be sash with a cute little baby shower buttons yeah i wore this as you would have probably seen in the little photo that i'm probably gonna upload as my baby shower thumbnail but yeah so these are the decorations and the presents sorry it's all my son <laughs> all over here these ones here are actually my birthday presents as it's my birthday in like a week but yeah these are all the presents so yeah let me get set up and i will show you these now so yes, very unprofessional of me, but I've actually put you in my food cupboard because I've got so much to do today and I want to get this filmed out. But these are my presents, so let me bring them over. First up, we've got baby shower cards. Some very cute designs. Very sweet. Here comes Chunky, as if you can see him in the background. So, I got a, a Sophia the Giraffe, which I love. I actually asked for this on my Amazon gift list. This sweet little comforter, which is a very cute colour. An outfit set, which has got a onesie. A vest, yeah, some trousers, and then a matching hat and bib, and they were all from Primark. And then also this, which again I asked for from Amazon, and it's like a wooden teether rattle and a matching dummy clip. Which I love. I wanted these for Orlando and I never got around to asking for them or buying them. So I'm very excited about that. And then this whole gift came in one of these. Oh, I love plastic storage. And these actually match the boxes that I already have at home, which is perfect. So yeah, that was one of the gifts. Let me show you another one. So this next gift is actually from my mum and dad. And it comes in this little box here. I had no idea what this was when I got it, but I am in love with it. Yes, I can see you. Give me one second, okay? It is this. Let me just get him some milk, one sec. Sorry. Yes, it's this box, which it says, baby, which is in a pink, like embroidered box. This is like leather. And inside is little compartments. So, first curl, first tooth, a first bracelet, keepsakes. And then it even has a big storage container underneath, which I love because Orlando doesn't have anything this fancy. So, it's quite nice for baby girl to have something that Orlando doesn't have because normally I find that the second child doesn't get as much stuff. Um, but that is not the case this time around. So, that is for my parents, and I absolutely love it i don't know where it's from so sorry can't give any advice on that one but yeah so it's a cute baby keepsake box so another one of my gifts which came in this bag here um this has got my favorite things in so i love baby toiletries but you know you just hate spending money on them especially the good ones like johnson's and things like that they're quite expensive so this is from my friend at work she got me a Big pack of water wipes you know that i love water wipes i just i'm too tired and too cheap to buy them 
So definitely going to be using these. I forget how heavy these are and it kind of makes you think that they are actually worth the money because they are so heavy that they clearly contain that much water. So yeah, a pack of water wipes. Some Johnson's bubble bath. I love this bath time, bedtime, bath time, wash, whatever you want to call it. The, oh, sorry, that's the... Oh. Okay, so this is the wash. So they actually like wash to wash them. This is the bath like bubbles and then she also got the matching bedtime powder again i love this range i used it with orlando we'll definitely use it with baby girl she also got me hat and mittens from primer will definitely be used and there's some very sweet sleep seats so these again from primer there's a florally one a pink one with a hedgehog and then a, just a pink and white striped one so I'm gonna wash these so she can wear them pretty much straight away. And then lastly, she got this adorable Minnie Mouse outfit, which comes with some matching tights. Um, and this is in size three to six. So yeah, I love this. And then to top it off, the other day at work, I brought her some chocolate and she was like, I needed to pay you back. So she got me some dairy milk. She knows me well. Next up, we've got this little gift here, which is in a very cute, like, um, shiny foil Winnie the Pooh bag. First up is this adorable outfit. This is from Asda. Um, so it's like a little bunny or rabbit or bear, I'm not really sure. But it's the softest dungaree material. And with some cute little ears and a matching t-shirt. And that's in 9 to 12 months. And then the sweetest little cardigan jumper. This is from Very. I don't really know that kids clothes were from Very, but apparently they are. Um, it's got the cutest little teddy bear ears, or rabbit ears with a little rabbit embroidered. That is so cute. It's so thick and warm. Um, what size is it? I don't actually know. Oh, three to six. So perfect for her over the winter months. And I just love the color. It's a very soft, but subtle pink. So yeah, I love that. They also got me some baby guys. So this is the Metalan um, baby character range. It is so cute in size six to nine. So it definitely will be used. These are so cute. I love these. So yeah, gonna get these washed as well. And then. Lastly, and this was from my Amazon wish list. It is a from Dodo Babies, which is the same company that I got that nursing cover shawl thing. That if you've watched my, oh, I don't even know, like maybe a nesting vlog that's in there. Um, but it's the same range. But these ones are the burp cloths. So it's a range of burp cloths like this. So you just put them on your shoulder rather than a muslin. So there's loads of these. These are going to be perfect for the nappy bag. So I love these. And as part of that set, it came with another dummy case, which is great because I need lots of these. And two matching dummy straps, which are very sweet. And then just to add to that, they also gave me, which again was on my wish list, some NUC dummies. I love the colors of them. They're very girly, but also very subtly. So they're not like bright pink in your mouth. And these are zero six, so I'll get these sterilized so we can use these basically straight away. And then last, but definitely not least, I got this. So this is a stroller caddy organizer. I do already have one of these, but this is a new one because my one is two years old now. It looks terrible. And this one is actually more of a waterproof material, whereas mine at the moment, as soon as it gets wet, it shows and it stains. So it does actually come so you can put the straps on like this or attach it to the stroller handles like so. I love these, I literally swear by these. Um, so you can put drinks on either side, lift this up, and there's a storage pocket in here, and this is actually where I store nappies and wipes when I get out, so you're going into the nappy bag. And then a see-through window here, so you can put your phone or your parking ticket or whatever you want in there. And then it's got a little pocket in the front here, which is like a mesh pocket. And then this pocket here, it's actually meant for like car keys and stuff, um, but I put snacks for Orlando in there, <laughs> or snacks for me, because it just makes it easier. But yeah, I absolutely love this, and this is definitely gonna get used. I'm actually gonna put this on the double buggy ready. 
but yeah that were all my presents uh, i was so so spoiled it was unreal especially because it's the second baby i didn't want to have a big thing because i feel like that's super selfish of me um but with the year that we've had and covid and everything i just thought it'd be nice to celebrate something small in life but yeah so thank you so much for watching guys um i will keep you updated on the pregnancy i am 36 weeks on friday can't remember when this vlog's going out i think it's going out on sunday so yeah i'm about 36 weeks pregnant um i've got a growth scan on friday so we'll see how everything goes there but there will definitely be a pregnancy update for you all which will probably be released after this vlog but thank you so much for watching guys and i will see you real soon bye